Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles. My life as a king. Part D. D. Omelette du fromage. Omelette du fromage. Insert Coin Kingdom. Day 20. Hey, girl. I did sleep well. Alright. Kill. Hey, good job, Rose. Uh oh, Lydia got her ass kicked. Let's just go to the goblins then. Lydia, you're level one. What? <laughs> I don't know. Oof, found a lot of elementite. Thank you. Great job, Rose. Got really high toughness, really high dex. No. Um, let's do... Let's do an agility medal. Actually, let's do strength. Yes. Alright, so we'll continue. Hey Ben, how you doing man? Good to see you. We'll continue with some experience for adventurers. Um, and then we'll post one. Where did we go? Goblin's Den. For exploration XP. We're gonna level some fools. Chapter 2, Cloak O Shadows. What up, Pavlov? Oh yeah, I ended up doing that a while back then. Drives me nuts, too. Gotta make them eye-catching while using the logo still. I think I've done a pretty good job of it. Developing, we're sure to get better trained adventurers, right? We'll unravel the mysteries of this land and rid us of its dangers. Exactly! For our safety and peace of mind, we need adventurers to go on more expeditions. You're damn right, Chime. So, Your Majesty, let's see what we can do about that today. Hmm? Yep, gotta start somewhere, man. It's, they make it so easy to do, so. House Plus! Is that like A Plus? Where's House Minus? Where's House Plus look like? Damn right you're at my service, fool. Never mind. Boop. Anybody that's burned out right now? Oops, wrong button. Get going, adventurers. Hey, Ash. What's up, buddy? What do you need, boy? You want to be in the show? You want to be on the stream? Say hello. Come here. Come on. Come on. You got to get up here. Come on. There you go. Say hi to everybody. Hi. Hi. Here, look. See? It's not going to bite you. You're a good boy. I love you. <sighs> My damn dog. 
upgrade their shields, their armor. Next special sales thing. some coin on that. What's going on, Magyash? See you again, Koopo! out in the Palum Day Caverns, you knob. Come on now. Freaking noob. You see this. You battled an imp and got your ass kicked in a level one area. You suck, dude. GG, bro. Coin. Gather up some more experience. It's level eight. It's our lowest level thing. Level six. Level nine. Level six. Go to the south way. She's an adventurer. Um, though it would be funny if it was, but... Her first battle, and she got her ass kicked. Good job, Juan. Oh, she's level 2 now, so she did gain a level at least, so there's something, I suppose. 
Well, and I don't have anything like the, um... I don't have any of the good stuff yet, either. Like, making them into white mages and shit like that. I don't have any of that yet. Ben, this is actually set in that same universe, but it's not the same game. There's an actual Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles, and this is um, set in the Crystal Chronicles universe. They did a whole bunch of games, including this, My Life is a Dark Lord, and there were a couple other Crystal Chronicles games that took place in the same universe. Actually, I think one of the Final Fantasy Tactics... I think one of the Tactics games did, too. I think A2... I thought A2 referenced Miasma. No? Yeah, but it's not the same one. Oh, it's not? Okay. Yes. And Wii games. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Soph. Soph says he wishes they had made another Crystal Chronicles. Fates Crystal Chronicles games, so. Yeah. I thought it was A2. I really think it is FFT A2. enjoy this game. I like the mix of strategy and a little bit of exploration. Like, not too much, but it's simple and fun. If 
I remember correctly, it really opens up later on in the later days when you get different classes and shit, like white mages and stuff. Yeah, so if I think that's the only thing that I wish this could do, is if you could do like and wreck a tier. Kind of go off on your with an adventurer and assist them. But I do really enjoy this game. It's fairly simple. It's a lot of fun to me. Holy shit. Well, good lord. Second origin. Now build gaming halls. Sweet. Be able to get thieves. Definitely have enough. I'm great! How are you? It's good to see you. <clears throat> Build a couple more houses. A couple more adventures. Let's build. Financial report. Brought in some 
funds. Oops. Yeah, Alright. So I need to finish up the west way here. Do some exploration there. You weren't late, I just started on time for once. <laughs> I'm always like 30 minutes behind in my timing. Okay. Cool, well I appreciate that a lot. Very fast paced game for sure. Very relaxing one. I'm probably gonna play for an hour, hour and a half before I switch over to uh, XCOM. XCOM 2. Hey man, I'm married. Got a steady flow of getting laid, bruh. Good chat. I'm talking to Soph. He said uh, he's still getting laid more than me. <laughs> oh, nice. Well done, Recky. Dealing the barbs. <laughs> you tell yourself that, so. the adventurers. Where? Where are the adventurers? Where are the adventurers? Don't recruit them. Get the hell out of here. <laughs> Hi, Nath. <laughs> Bakery Plus. 
that like an auto upgrade or, or what? Or what? The fuck is this? Do it to it, guys. <laughs> For me, it's just usually crying and frustration. Rest time. Bum, bum, ba, ba, bum, bum, bum. Day twenty seven. Levels left and right, yo. Productive day. Yee-hoo. Shiba doobie. Shut up, Ricky. <laughs> Don't judge me. Well, it's um, it's pretty much a uh, this game's a um, kind of like a town management type game where you play kind of, if you ever played any of the uh, Dungeon Keeper games, it's kind of the reverse of that. You kind of manage the city, build it up, and manage the adventurers, um, and send them on quests, or behests as they're called in this game. And then they go and collect items and things like that and bring them back to you, um, and then they level up independently of you while you manage the city. Thanks, self, I guess. It's weird. But yeah, pretty much this game is, uh... Um, it's pretty straightforward, um... If I remember correctly, it does pick up a little bit later, but um, it's uh, it's very simple, which I love. Um, it makes life very easy. But it involves a lot of this, where you know you send people out to do these quests, and then they unlock something, you build it. And then you work on getting them... The overall goal is you use the class system to turn them into thieves, or white mages, or black mages, or whatever. 
For you it does, so. Not necessarily for me, though. But, uh, unfortunately, simplicity gets monotonous real fast. Yeah, it is pretty dependent. Yep, it's pretty dependent on the game for me as well. Some gulch. Boop. God, we'll get more people interested in this. Then. Well, you know. That is your opinion. Nothing wrong with that. It's just I disagree. Commission all adventurers. Hopefully I'll get some thieves here soon. Exit. Simplicity is the best kind of simplicity. Don't have to think too, too hard about it. And... Hey, I got thieves. Got a fuckload of thieves. Well, didn't mean to get that many fucking thieves, but okay. Works for me. Now I know that if you send them on that, then... Um, they all become thieves. So I just turned like half of my people into thieves. Like, I think Portal Knights off offers that um, kind of simplicity. It's not super complex, not difficult, but um, definitely has the different biomes and um, kind of the jumping around type type thing, which I think is a pretty positive thing in my opinion. Thieves now. Oh, Lydia got knocked unconscious again. Lydia, stop sucking. What's that? Oh, I think it has like six or seven. Maybe eight. Yeah, it depends on how you uh, how you want to digest it. At gods, like Soph said, um, if you if you watch the uh, vods on Twitch, they will let they will let you see chat. Um, the only downside is they go away after like six or seven days.
Or if it's a stream like this where I have chat up up there. Oops. I did not mean to do that. Yep, exactly so. Folder videos. Um hit up YouTube. And if you're wanting to catch up with what happened in like the last week, watch the VODs on Twitch. right. <laughs> disturbing. So disturbing. Hey, for a while, good to see you, man. So I installed some mods on XCOM, so before I launch it, I need to back up my save games, but, um, I think it's gonna be, um, for the better. I picked out a lot of really cool mods, like extra nick randomized nicknames, um, tons of, uh, just tons of mods. I went through on my lunch break and, um, figured out what I wanted. But, um, they, they warned to back up your saves, and in some they won't work at all, um, because you gotta start a new one. That's the one I got, Ben. Yeah. It's one of the ones I got. I got that, and then the auto, or the, um, uh, the Overwatch mod, which lets you put everyone who, all your people into Overwatch, or, um, uh, everyone else but the one you're using in Overwatch. Back all. I'll look at that before I start it up later. I'm actually, very excited to play it again. Had a really good time yesterday, so. None of those yet, so. Yet. I can turn them into stormtroopers. Actually, there's some really cool helmet mods. I got a whole bunch of different, like, uh, um, prop mods, and uh, I got one that enhances the randomization of the maps a bit. It adds new plots and stuff that can be randomized in. So it's really, um, I, I learned the way that they handle um, generation of the worlds in, in XCOM. It's really freaking cool. Um, they have what are called parcels, which are like individual, like, buildings and stuff, and then each map has a certain amount of plots. It like randomizes the amount of plots that it can put the parcels on, and they're different sizes. And so it will actually throw plots of the correct size in there, and then the more you have, the more variety you have in a map, and they all look different. So it randomizes based on a 
couple of factors, and it's kind of cool, because that's why every map looks different. It's all RNGesus. I'm very excited to see how it, uh, how it pans out with the mods. I may need to start a new game, but it might be for the better, because I, I know... I know more about what I'm doing. Um, I might go into my current save game um, if I can and uh, um, save all of my characters to the pool, do some edit minor editing on them all, give them kind of bios or something, or uh, maybe not bios, but do some editing on them and have them so that they're saved so that I can always use them. There are a couple of really cool uh, mods for bringing in people as well. Um, at Gods, it's on my list. Um, I think I'm probably going to be um, Pokemon XD first, um, Gale of Darkness, um, which I may play either this weekend or early next week, and then Crystal, I'm hoping to get back into the, um, that next weekend. So a couple of weeks. I've just got a lot of games on my plate this month. Um, actually, I'll, I'll link you guys. I have like a ridiculously large list of games. Pokemon Crystal Meth. Nice. Submit. So right now I've got... This is my list of games. <clears throat> that I currently have that are unfinished that I've started on stream and intend to finish at some point. So... I will be working through this list um, to kind of try to trim it down a bit. That's why I'm playing Crystal Chronicles right now. Um, and um, but yeah, Pokemon Crystal I will definitely get back to. I fully plan on it. It's just not on the top of my list, and that's not necessarily in order. That's just in general. Yeah, unfortunately, I couldn't do the R. They have a limit on their characters, and I can't delete the account and recreate it with, like, just without vowels or something. So, unfortunately, I'm stuck with Insert Coin V8. Not much I can do about it. Their platform is a little bit icky in that regard. No, no ragrets. Rescuer. <laughs> Red Rescuer team. I'm the best. Got my back.
<laughs> Don't do that. Don't do that. Good morning, Your Majesty. I'm hemorrhaging money. Seven. Are you dumb? You gain experience, fool. No, 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 no. I do, I have my phone back. I'm updating it to Lollipop right now. Right. Yep, Lydia's dead. <laughs> Moron. Okay. Rip Lydia. Day. I don't know exactly what I'm trying to do here. To be perfectly honest. My adventurers are weary. Sarah Chan doesn't love me anymore, that's why she never hangs out.
Why, why that number, so... Save, take over, and hop on over to XCOM. Ding! Save is done. Alright. Let's cut over to XCOM. Goodbye to YouTube.